Hi, my name's Ned, and welcome to Smithcast. Okay, so that's the aluminium. That's also some aluminium arrived. We've got this guy fired, but this guy, we kind of horsed it along a little bit, and we blew off the side. They've been lying in the dump for a little while. We should have uh, should have put them into the kiln and done it on a slow burn. But this guy is also uh, fired, also, so he's ready to go. So let me introduce you to these guys. What we are at, well, we've been charged to cast these brackets. These brackets are used on aerials, TV masks, um, so these guys need lots of them. They sell them around the world, so it does something like this. It locks these things in and they can build large structures, repair large structures and all of that kind of good stuff. So, we have this one to do, there is another one, there is different types. So this one is the one we're on today. So what, how are we doing that with this aluminium that we've got? And this guy, I'll show you this guy a little bit closer here. So. These are made of steel, tool steel, and what we've got is we've got the pattern split down the middle. We've got these pins that are tractable from the each side. We have two pins here, two pins there, they make the holes. So basically, when it comes to this, really needs a lot of heat. The, these molds need a lot of heat, preheat. So then it comes together like so. Clamp, clamp. Drive these molds, uh, drive these. It's a little bit cold right now, so a wee bit stiff. Drive these in. It's ready for pouring. It's heated. Pour in. Then we go back as we. It doesn't take long for this to be able to be knocked out, so then. When they're knocked in, then it's a matter of just prising these back, then prise and open the mould with these. Creating noise. Oops. No. Yeah, that's it. There we go. So there. And then these two pins at the back are driven and knock out the pattern. And then back again, bit of a spray, put it back in and go again. Uh, yeah, and this this piece is for the little half moons that go with this bracket. These pieces, they go with that bracket. That's your down sprue. This comes up like this. And again, all of this is preheated. Two sections. See it there. So all of this is preheated uh, and needs a lot of heat. Let's get to it. We're going to experiment a little bit more. Uh, this is all new to us. So we've got to get a lot of heat into this and a lot of heat into this. Preheat. Uh, and then we'll get the furnace lit. Okay, uh, just getting a lot of heat into the moles, these are the little half moons. This is this.
okay, I hope you can hear me. The way we're going to do this is that once this is ready, we're experimenting here for the first first go. So we want to get the, the mold ready, post up ready. Then I'll go over here. I uh, have got a ladle big enough. So I have to ladle it into a crucible, which is heat. Put the stuff into the crucible, then do the pour. But hopefully it'll just have one ladle, then the pour. If you get the ladle. pretty well there we got ourselves a nice cast that's what I wanted to achieve we have a lot of adaption to do to the process um, because we're not lifting the crucible and casting we're dipping into the crucible and pouring in uh, decanting and then pouring there's a few things I want to make just to kind of make the process run a little bit smoother uh, well normally not for this video but for later on I gotta make a lot more numbers of these uh, and then we're on to the next project. But if you've liked what you've seen, uh, please give us a thumbs up or even better still, uh, subscribe, that'd be even better. And uh, yeah, keep it lit. Until the next time. Okay, I better get on and uh, make a lot more of these. Hmm. Okay, let's go.